The trade of the day is E-mini S&P after hours. And so taking a look at this, getting in right at the open on, the, on this current trading session and exiting at 2 a.m. Central Standard Time plus 1337.50. So getting in here, uh, took a little bit of heat down here and then the market rallied. Big rally as, as Europe, Europe opened, and then as Europe opened, the market sold off. So can be some transition in the change in trend when Europe opens. And so that was good timing on that trade. So that is the trade of the day so far overnight. Night Trader did not trade. A 60-minute breakout did. And buying that breakout uh, as the market went up was a losing trade. We had a winning trade yesterday. And so buying the dips are, are better have been better lately than buying the breakouts. Uh, not always. You see that as when the market when the market sells off and then it the reversal is real. The breakouts off of lows can work, but breakouts at highs don't always work as well. It's not easy to describe when you should do that and when you should not in a trading system. And if you do that too intricately, you could optimize over optimize it. And so it's a basic breakout strategy, adaptive moving average. Up yesterday, gave back some of the close. Up today, just have this uh, breakaway gap on Monday and then sideways action on Tuesday. A lot of chopping here when Jerome Powell spoke. He spoke earlier today and uh, testified. And so adaptive moving average is up 725 on the day. Tick count trend, two winning trades so far, plus 437.50. Taking the short trade there. Um, gap continuation lost on this minus 650 two losing trades here Cobra CT3 one of the nice trades on the day got the low of this move this is why we cancel and replace limit orders to the market and don't hold them um, otherwise you'd miss a trade like this 29 38 25 plus 800 on the day this is in the 25k portfolio so nice trade on Cobra CT3 and so Cobra CT3 adaptive moving average and tick count trend two are the top trades in the top strategies in this workspace while gap continuation and 60 minute breakout both taking breakouts and down on the day I'll strategy access two we have QS3 one of our favorite strategies to trade at the open QS means quick start you can get that quick bid at the open under certain under certain conditions so it timed that pretty well see a quick move higher just a little bit of a pullback right here and then it moved higher so very quick trade to hit its profit target a plus 875 and so that that's the only trade in this workspace today that's in the portfolio 60 minute breakout is not in on the NQ is not in the portfolio um, and so the all strategy access or the stock index portfolio includes these 19 strategies as well as 17 of these strategies. It doesn't include tick pulse. You'll get these strategies, but we're not currently recommending these two strategies right now. So 19 plus 17 is 36. You also get ES after hours with the stock index portfolio. So that's the stock index portfolio, all strategy access one and two. And if you have the all strategy access, you get all strategy access three, which is Asia gold down on the day, minus 525, Cobra euro plus 150. Um, Grains Day Trader 3 plus 137.50. Uh, All Strategy Access 4, 2. Uh, nice trades here. SR Counter Trend 3 overnight. A and B and Crude Oil hitting their profit targets at plus 475 and catching a nice cyclical move there. As you can see, kind of a lot of little waves in here and it captures that turning point really well on this move today. So plus 475 on both of those. And then All Strategy Access 5. There are no trades today, and those are the trades on the day. Once again, E-mini S&P after hours was the trade of the day. How do these look in the 25K portfolio? You see today, Cobra CT3, one minute plus 762.50, uh, gap continuation minus 650, and those are the trades so far. The market has kind of calmed down quite a bit. Margins have been lowered, and I think the crude oil margins will I sent an email out this morning about crude oil margins being lowered. I think they're going to be lowered even more um, today the, at the exchange level. So the exchange level maintenance margin, overnight margin, 
will be lowered, so your brokerage margin for crude oil will also be lowered as well. So those are the trades. This should be SR counter. This should be uh, June, uh, July crude oil. I've changed these two. I need to change this one. It should just be at CLN20 if you have trade station. So let me change that real quick. So I know I was missing something there. Um, an additional plus 475 today on SR counter trend three crude oil trading the July contract. So bounce back day in the 25K portfolio.